Hey guys, in this video, I will show you how you can fix Steam no license found. So without further ado, let's get started. First of all, go and go to Steam, go to Steam icon on the top left, then go to settings, and then on settings, you need to go to downloads and then clear download cache. And after that, Steam will restart and you just need to look if the problem persists or not. Uh, if the problem persists, go to interface, then you need to go to a, a client beta participation here, and then expand this option and look for Steam families and select it. If Steam Families is not available for you, you just need to select Steam Beta Update and then restart Steam and look if the problem persists or not. If the problem persists, then open a browser and then you just need to write Goldberg, Goldberg Emulator and probably it will be the first link here. You just need to press on it and then you just need to download the latest build here and then save it to desktop or whatever you like. And then you just need to uh, extract uh, files here. Let's, let's extract it to uh, desktop. And then here you will see some files. So if, you, if you're using Windows, you just need to copy uh, these two files here. If you're using Linux here, uh, if you're using 32-bit, uh, you need to file, copy these files. If you're using 64-bits, uh, use these files. And then you just need to find your uh, problematic game. So go to Steam. Uh, then you just need to go to your game directory, go to properties, install files, browse, and then you just need to paste that these two DLL files where is a, that particular game exe is located. So usually is on the main screen here, but in this case, as you can see here, there is no exe file. So I just need to probably it will be on bin, uh, win64, and then as you can see here, uh, here. And then you just need to paste these files, replace it. Uh, then what you need to do here is to completely uh, close your Steam. So uh, go to Task Manager. And then you just need to uh, go to Steam here. Uh, then look for Steam, go to Details, and then end all the things here and Task. And then Steam services will automatically will be closed. And then relaunch Steam and the issue should be solved. So yeah, that's basically it. If I helped you out, please press like button and subscribe for more. Take care. Bye.